Hello everyone, this is the second screencast for our GCF. It is how to find the greatest common factor using a Venn diagram. The Venn diagram is usually used hand in hand with the list method. So I'm going to look back to my previous screencast and the list method that I did. And I'm going to create a Venn diagram where my black circle is for 12 factors, my red circle is for 30 factors, and the circle where the circles overlap in the middle, which would be my blue section, is for the factors that they share. So, over look at my previous screencast, and I saw that 1, 2, and 3 are factors that are shared, and also 6. Now, the factors for 12, and only 12, would be 4 and 12, and the factors for 30, and only 30, would be 5, 10, 15, and 30. So if I want to look for my greatest common factor, you look in the middle for the shared factors, and the largest one is 6. So my GCF, or greatest common factor, would be 6. And again, how I would use this is if I had a fraction of 12 thirtieths, and I want to reduce it to simplest form. I can take my GCF and I can divide by 6, the numerator, divide by 6, the denominator. I get 2 fifths. 12 thirtieths is equivalent to 2 fifths, but 2 fifths is in simplest form. It's reduced, for, you know, it's, reduced it's a reduced fraction. Now, I could have reduced 12 thirtieths by any of the common factors. I could have did 12 divided by 2 the numerator, and 30 divided by 2, but then I get 6 fifteenths, which is equivalent to 12 thirtieths, but it's not in lowest terms. I'd have to reduce it again.